गुड मॉर्निंग चिल्ड्रेन साई राम हाई एवरीबडी हाव यू ऑल आई एम ऑल्सो फाइन चिल्ड्रेन थैंक यू सो हाउ वॉज योर गणपति वेकेशन डिट गणपति बापा कम टू योर हाउस यू एट मोदक येस यू मस्ट हैव एंजॉयड राइट नाउ यू वेकेशन इज कमिंग टू एन एंड now let's back to our studies now this is a boy right what you what else you can see yes his hair is very long the same way when your hair has become a little longer what your mummy says to you bachcha come we will cut your Yes, and we'll go to a barber. And what does he do? He cut your hairs properly, right? And you know how does a salon look? A barber shop. When you go, you can see mirror, chair, right? And many other cosmetic products. What do you do? You sit on the chair and. a uh, uncle or an auntie comes to you and cut your hair right and when she or he cuts your hair you look good so you should always look your self nicely so today we are going to learn a new rhyme on uh bab so are you all ready children let's get start first i will say the poem then you can all repeat after me so let's get started title of the poem is a uh, barber first i will say children barber barber cut my hair clip it your and clip it there apply all your skill and art please make me look bright and smart right children when you go to the barber shop what he does he take he clips and clip it here and there and he starts cutting okay so shall we repeat okay title of the poem is a barber ready okay barber barber cut my hair clip it your and clip it there apply all your skill and art please make me look bright and smart isn't the nice poem children a very short poem so shall we repeat one more time okay title of the poem is a barber 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 cut my hair clip it your and clip it there apply all your skill and art please make me look bright and smart nice poem na children 
Okay, now it's time for the activity. So let's get started. So for the activity, we require a small piece of foil paper and different type of clay. So first, we are going to make a comb. I have taken orange color. You can take your favorite color. Roll it and make two parts. One part should be of smaller size and the other would be a bigger one. Roll it. Press it now. You can keep down. Press it like this. And keep it as aside. Now take the smaller one, roll it, and do this way in a cylindrical shape or this way. Keep it down, press a little. Now take this part and this, you join it. Now take other color. I have taken yellow color. Take a small portion of it. Roll it. Same way. Press it. So I have flattened this. Now keep over it. Now we'll take some toothpick, we'll do it in half like this. Now take help of your mummy to break it properly. Now we have got this much. Now we'll take this color, any color of your choice. Roll it and then this way. Don't take larger portion. Take small, small only. Then take this toothpick and put it inside. Or you can just over it and just overlap it. And you can put it here. The same way we are going to do the other one. So we have done a few. So we will start putting. Like this. Place all this properly. And see, your comb is ready. You can put more toothpick also if you want. Okay? Now we'll keep this aside. So for the scissor, now we have taken green color. You can take any color of your choice. Take a small portion and just roll it. Take another one and roll it. So this two is done. With the help of the thumb, we are going to just press it softly. Don't press too hard. Softly. Keep it like this. In a this shape. Like a V. And take another green color. Small portion. Roll it.
now we will just turn it like this like a round and then place it here same way we will do it make a round stick like this and keep it here now take any other color i have taken yellow roll it and press it with your thumb and place it in here in the middle now this is your scissor ready so this foil paper we are going to make a mirror take any other color of clay roll it and then like this so i have made four like this so we are going just to pick it up and just on the border we are going to place it extra part you can cut it with a toothpick take the other one likewise only i am going to do with the next three sides now i just going to press the corner so that it doesn't move out and here also you can do it a little with the help of your thumb and with this toothpick just do like this now it's a design for the frame a zigzag line will also do now this is your mirror ready see i have placed it this is your comb scissor and a mirror that we use or you see at the barber shop so children did you like the activity do it bachcha bye